When we talk about sustainability today in the packaging and processing environment, it is an ingrained business approach, an ingrained business element that must be considered for any packaging that is going through the retailer to the consumer. Having said that, the understanding that we need is to recognize that a fully costed product is still the most expensive part of what's being delivered to the consumer. Packaging has the need and responsibility. One of the main emphasis of packaging is to protect the product throughout the supply chain so that when we take a look at introducing those sustainable elements, we're still emphasizing the ultimate need to protect the package because the package is what has the most cost and that package is the element that's being delivered and utilized by the consumer. In food, we want it to be fresh. We want it to have a good quality and we want it to be safe make sure that whatever we're doing on the approach to sustainability is still providing that for the package going to the consumer. The Food Safety Modernization Act came into law in early January. Now all the regulations associated with that are working their way through the various governmental agencies. Food safety was always an established element of food. We want a good product to come to the consumer's table to be consumed by the consumer. Having said that, the understanding is that the Food Safety Modernization Act will drive some additional emphasis points within food operations, probably on the supply chain to understand what ingredients are going into the package and the source of those ingredients and almost definitely on the packaging side to be able to focus on the uh, tracking and tracing of the product throughout the supply chain. Not just from the ingredients, but all the way through to the distribution and the retailer so that if there is any issue with a recall, it can be quickly identified where the affected products are or where they've been sold. I think when we talk about food supply safety, especially as we take a look at the packaging operation, is to be able to implement those track and trace elements so that you can look at the ingredients that go into the food package and ultimately the material and the, the final result that's going through the retailer and to the consumer. The ability to provide that track and trace, to automatically collect information about the ingredients that are going in and link what is uh, going in as the ingredients all the way through to the final package is an integral element of helping with the food safety. We'll see at Pack Expo Las Vegas a number of companies that are implementing either solutions or services that can provide the assistance to the food manufacturers that will be important to make sure they are complying with the Food Safety Modernization Act and to providing a package that all of us as consumers want to have and to enjoy when we get home. When we talk about the key issues that might be addressed or industry leaders will be talking about at PAC Expo, of course we'll talk about the Food Safety Modernization Act and the impl implications that that has for any food manufacturing uh, concern. We also want to take a look at healthier ingredients or new packaging formats that ultimately all of us are consumers. We want to have that specific package that meets our need. It could be that it's a single serve. It could be that it's a service for two individuals because of the size of the household. We want what we want as consumers. And what we are looking for is the professionals in the food side to be able to provide that that range of solutions will be available from portion size to different materials to different packaging formats throughout the halls of Pack Expo Las Vegas. And of course, I say to all, please continue that networking to enable yourself to learn from the other professionals that are there at the show. Take advantage of that opportunity to meet one-on-one -on -one and learn something new while you're walking the halls. Step outside the bounds of your just your particular market segment. If it's candy, think about something that's in fresh fruit. If it happens to be fresh fruit, think about something that may be happening in liquid uh, foods or in beverages. 
We don't know what it may mean for you. It's you going through with an open mind and saying, that might help me in my business. That's the opportunity to walk the halls at PAC Expo.